Welcome back to Meet PUG. In this lesson, we'll play with if, else, and unless. Cool. So last time we've played with buffer code. However, we forgot to make a commit. So let's do that quickly now. I stage it, and I'll say this is buffered code in PUG. Commit it. Sync it. And now let's get back to our files and do another folder into src conditionals and in conditionals new file if else unless ug. Now let's write some code. Okay, so now we've got this um, object over here called UpData, which has a title and a slogan, and another variable authenticated set to true. Okay, so in our case, we do have a code UpData and the title and a slogan actually. So we are looking to see if code up slogan exists. So code UpData is this one, and then the slogan is this one over here. Okay which means it exists and then this h1 outputs this one and this code up info is this code up info and the slogan follows afterwards this is speaker slogan which comes from this one cool bad drawings but that's kind of it now let's quickly clear that screen and do a uh, slogan one so now if we save it we can see that well slogan no longer exists which means it's going to check if authenticated exists and is set to true and it's going to render this welcome back to code up and which is over here welcome back to code up it's this one then this is the slogan and this is the slogan over here okay now if we are to quickly set this to false we can see that the last one takes effect so we got this h1 over here connect with us you should connect with us and then the p so basically, this is if, else if, and else. And then there is another one, which is unless. Let's uh, quickly write some code. So the unless is the same as you would say if and negate authenticated. So we can see that we get this twice. This, these two are one and the same. If we use unless and you're expecting it not to be true or you're using if and you negate a false to make it positive and you get the same effect. So those were the conditionals. So that was if, else, else if and unless. I never play with unless. It's easier for me to just uh, negate the if condition. Now let's see each other in the next lesson where we'll see or we'll quickly see doc type.